learned about vibrating columns of air. So in this demo, I've got three bottles, and each of them are the same bottle, same shape, uh, but they have different amounts of liquid in it. This one is nearly empty, this one is about a third full, and the last one is about two thirds full. So if I blow across the top of this bottle, they are gonna excite a vibrating column of air and give me a sound. The question is, which of these three bottles produces the highest frequency sound? We want the highest frequency, the highest F sound. So, pause your video, think about this for a second, play around with the equations, and then input your answer, and we'll see which one is the highest frequency. Okay, now that you've guessed which one is the highest frequency, let's take a look. Let's start <coughs> with this one over here. I'm blow across the top. Sight a column of air vibrating, we'll hear the sound. There we go, pretty low. Definitely higher. Highest frequency. Okay, so the bottle that's the that's the most full produces the highest frequency sound. So let's talk about why. So for a vibrating column of air, if we vibrate in fundamental mode, we have exactly one quarter of a wavelength that's vibrating inside our container. So if we want to draw the line through the middle, we can draw, we can illustrate why this is one quarter wavelength. So that would be half a wavelength, and that would be one full wavelength, right? So exactly. Uh, L here, the length of my container, is one quarter of the wavelength. But that's true for all the bottles, right? If they're all bouncing off the top of the liquid, then this one, the length of vibrating column, is the smallest, okay? And if uh, length here is proportional to the wavelength there, that means the wavelength here has got to be the smallest. Well, we know for waves that the velocity of sound in air for this vibrating column is F times lambda. So if we solve there, F equals V over lambda. So if we want the highest frequency there, we need the lowest value of the wavelength, which is our bottle, which is two thirds full. So give it a try at home.